America's Deadliest Twister, The Tri-State Tornado of 1925 by Jeff Partlow chronicles the devastating impact of the most lethal tornado in U.S. history. The book meticulously details the events of March 18, 1925, when a single monstrous tornado tore through Missouri, Illinois, and Indiana over the course of three and a half hours, leaving a path of destruction over 219 miles long. This natural disaster ranks as the longest track twister ever recorded and remains unmatched in terms of its breadth, speed, and deadlines. The book traces the tornado from its formation near Ellington, Missouri, to its dissipation near Princeton, Indiana. Covering stories of loss, survival, and community resilience, Partlow reconstructs the fateful day using extensive research, survivor interviews, and historical records. The tornado struck with little warning, as weather forecasting in the 1920s was in its infancy, lacking the radar technology and communication systems necessary for effective storm tracking and warnings. As the tornado traveled, it obliterated the town of Annapolis, Missouri, before crossing the Mississippi River and rampaging through southern Illinois. The communities of Gorham, Murfreesboro, and DeSoto bore the brunt in Illinois and experienced horrific destruction and a significant loss of life. The author describes how schools, homes, and businesses were erased from the landscape, with Murfreesboro alone recording 234 fatalities, the highest number of deaths in a single city due to a tornado in U.S. history. Partlow emphasizes the human stories amidst the disaster, drawing a vivid and emotional picture of the chaos experienced by the victims. He presents accounts of families being torn apart, parents losing children, and survivors being injured and traumatized. Numerous individual acts of heroism and tragedy feature prominently, such as teachers attempting to shield their students from the storm and injured individuals assisting others amidst their own suffering. The speed and ferocity of the tri-state tornado were such that it generated a series of bizarre phenomena, often highlighted in the narrative. Objects were found miles away from their origins, cars were lifted and tossed aside like toys, and even the landscape itself was altered, with trees debarked and soil scoured from the earth. In the aftermath of the tornado, Partlow describes how communities confronted the staggering toll of death and injury. More than 700 people were killed, with thousands injured and countless others left homeless. Recovery efforts were chaotic due to the magnitude and extent of the damage, with makeshift morgues and hospitals being set up, and relief efforts pouring in from neighboring regions and states. The book also delves into the period following the immediate disaster, highlighting the challenges of rebuilding and the psychological scars borne by survivors. Amidst the tragedy, there were stories of resilience as people banded together to rebuild their lives and communities. This catastrophe also spurred advancements in meteorology and disaster preparedness. Recognizing the inadequate warning systems of the time, efforts were made to improve weather forecasting and emergency communication to prevent such loss of life in future events. The tri-state tornado's impact on American history can be seen through the changes it incited in public safety and weather science. The book acknowledges the formative role the disaster played in shaping modern tornado awareness programs, including the use of storm sirens, tornado drills in schools, and the establishment of the Storm Prediction Center, intended to provide accurate, timely tornado warnings. Partlow's work stands as a memorial to the victims of the tri-state tornado and serves as a historical document of the monumental disaster. Through painstaking research and compelling narrative, America's Deadliest Twister provides an informative and emotive exploration of the tri-state tornado's effects on society, the environment, and the field of meteorology. It resonates with the reader not only as a chronicled history of a catastrophic event, but also as a testament to human perseverance in the face of unfathomable destruction. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.